Hello, this is a Hamilton self-winding uh, vintage watch from the 1970s and uh, I really like this one. I thought I'd uh, show you around, see what you think. Now just before we start, uh, I'll just point out that the bracelet is not original. That's a, a, a newish textile leather-backed bracelet that I thought gave it a cool vintage look. Um, anyway, we're going to look at the watch itself. So, Hamilton. Lovely applied H logo at the 12 with Hamilton in um, italic capitals underneath. Self-winding at 6. And down at the bottom there, Swiss made, which is nice. And it's an automatic watch. They call it self-winding. And in there is a Hamilton 837 movement, which is a modified ETA 2879. And that's got uh, day and date. And uh, it keeps incredible time. For a watch that's pushing 50 years old, it's, uh, it's remarkable. Put it on and away it ticks. But a little movement and away it ticks. And it keeps ticking for up to two days, close to two days. And the timekeeping is, is within a couple of seconds. It is truly, truly remarkable for, for a simple old watch. But, oh man, it's lush. So let's have a, have a look, look at the details. So we've got the, um, the indices, applied thick indices. I'm, uh, I'm reflecting it on purpose so you can see the depth of the indices. Uh, so the indices all the way around with little minute uh, painted minute dashes in between. Obviously, there's one missing at the uh, at the date at three for the date and the uh, day, which is beautifully framed. And you see, there's got a little uh, silver framed window, and that's it. The hands, nice simple button hands with loom at the ends. The hour and the minute hand, the same design. Uh, the minute hand reaching all the way out just to the minute and the hour hand just to be in front of the uh, the hour indice, indice, indice. Well, I don't know what the, the singular is for indices. It must be indice. I don't know. And the second hand, nice simple silver second hand ticking away quite smoothly. Nice, isn't it? So let's keep looking around. So it's a, as you can see, the, the shape of the of the watch is sort of a TV shape, and uh, it's got a lovely acrylic flat acry acrylic crystal, um, raised slightly, and the case is uh, it's got a lovely shape to it. Very um, sort of traditional watch shape. Nice lugs pointing slightly downwards, slightly angular, and uh, polished sides. Signed crown, can you see there with the H logo? And then on the back, nice and simple, Hamilton, stainless steel, water resistant, 837027-3. And then um, I've loosened the case back so we can have a look at the movement. I thought you might like to have a look. So here is the, the movement. And it's nice. It's really nice. And then just... Uh, Whilst we've got the case back off, and I've got it upside down there, you can see it says H Hamilton Watch Co. Swiss. So I'll just pop that back on, just loosely, I'll tighten it later. And then back to the front. So, another cool feature is it's a quick set, which uh, is quite remarkable again. So uh, pull it once out and you can change the date, the day I should say, and it's English and Spanish. And then turn it the other way and you change the date. And then pull it to the second stop and you can change the time. And that's it. Beauty, isn't it? Let's give it a little measure. It's quite a diminutive little fella. It's 33 millimeters uh, by, well, square. But because of the shape of it, the TV shape, uh, it doesn't wear as small as that. I'm just going to come zoom out a bit so you can see it. So I've got a seven and a half inch wrist and I, I think that looks really cool. Nice retro small, but not teeny. 
and it just feels great and it looks great now i didn't go into into uh detail about the dial did i now the dial look at, look at the beautiful dial lovely linen I'm, I'm reflecting on purpose so that we can see the light playing against the fantastic linen dial look at that silver linen dial it's lush anyway you could you can tell i really like it that's it i hope you've enjoyed watching this little hamilton self-winding watch tour have a look around my channel i do other watch reviews i also do edc and knife reviews a little subscribe would be nice a thumbs up a like if you liked it comment below if you know anything about this watch uh, or want to chat about it i'd be happy to join in with you i really appreciate you watching thanks very much i'll see you soon